Hi guys, Eric here from Laser Skin TV and today I have very brand new uh, information for you. I have the first outlook for the new Faro Orbis, the new hybrid scanner who combine the world of mobile laser scanning, SLAM technology and terrestrial scanning in one only device, uh, very new on the market. Uh, and I have an outlook on this system and if you are interested what this system can revolutionize your scan workflow, then stay tuned. Guys, uh, here we have now the picture of the new Faro Orbis. This system is uh, based on the GeoSlam technology. As you are maybe new in the market, uh, Faro have acquired GeoSlam company for around one year. And this uh, system was still under development to this time. And now it's the final release out. I think also that Faro have uh, bring some of their technology and ideas and software technology inside in the whole package. And now they release it to the Intergeo. And, but for people that are familiar, they say, okay, the design looks pretty similar to the previous version from GeoSlam. Okay, the color is changed now to the Faro blue but for the people that are in the market they see that this one looks completely different this means we have a new sensor inside here this is one of the uh, improvement of the new system but uh, I think the more and the more bigger improvement is the point that we found now uh, combined here complete new technologies and this is what we see here they call them the hybrid reality capture scan and they call them flash hybrid and this is the world on, on from two scan measures. We have the SLAM systems, like GeoSLAM was before, and uh, we have the terrestrial scanner, like the Faro Focus. And with the new device, you can use the SLAM technology, but you are able to stop and do terrestrial scan. And that's the reason why they call them the hybrid reality capture scanner, because you have both systems in one. And this gives you a pretty good advantage. I have to move forward here, that you can start, then you walk in the SLAM, scan walking mode and if you need a, a area with more precise data and higher quality data then you can stop there push a button and then the system captured one uh, single scan in 15 seconds uh, like a terrestrial scan then you move to the next position and you can move to the whole building and you can finish this in five minutes this one 530 with colors I think this was something what you've done in the past uh, for one single scan for one room. I think it's a big revolution. I think you can be now up to 10 times faster is what they say and what is super realistic. And I can jump back and show you a little bit how it uh, works in reality. You see here this guy let the initialization one, then he grabbed the scanner and then he start to work in the slam mode like we do it usually. You see he's working and then he works to the end and then he on this position he like to do a static scan he stop say create a flash scan now the system create a flash scan in around 15 seconds you can see it yeah that's pretty live here what we see it's like also the scan time is realistic it's not faked or something it's uh, what you can expect and now he is moving forward and now he's going forward and here he like to do another terrestrial scan 15 seconds on this position do another scan and then he is right back here go back to the original point and then he is closing and that's very great that's super nice and we have here also the option with the new scanner that we have a complete new developed sensor usually also the older horizon system and most competitive system or all competitive system use like laser scan heads for more autonomous driving like Velodyne, Hesai is very common in the market and they use this technologies and this scanner usually defined by 15 millimeter to 30, 40, 50 millimeters uh, scanning accuracy or a longer range and they can only achieve better results if they really do a hard filtering on the noisy point cloud and with, with this system you have now a point cloud what is the system is developed for mapping and this liver the precise five millimeters from the sensor not from filtering i think that's a big difference and this big difference you can see here in the scan data looks here how great they are looks or here we have a tga uh, scan view here this looks for me like tripod scanner for three four years uh, of course, the tripod scanner have one millimeter accuracy, now we have five, but this is something where somebody can model 
this uh, MEP data out, or here we see this Oracle view, this Oracle building, and then we have also here some, some from, you see here some uh, outside scanning, and I find also something else here. Looks, this was the previous version, and now the data quality from the new scanner, it is a big difference, you can see it. Definitely data where you can work with, and that's a thing, the, the great point you have. Uh, super, like if you see before we had like, I would say like 50 millimeters uh, accuracy in this GeoSlam. Of course, sometimes they say they can be better, but now you're on five, that means you are three times better data quality, less noise, I think noise will be a couple of times better. And then you have this hybrid workflow from uh, having the SLAM algorithms and can do tripod scan in one uh, scan walk, uh, that's super great. And then you have also two options for your data uh, processing. You can use the stream app, and after you're finished, you can send it to the cloud and let process the data on the cloud and get the point cloud back. Or if you like to do it on your own computer, you have the other option. Take it out from the machine, put it on your local PC if data safety is important for you, or if you like to have more control, or you are an advanced user like to do this. Faro offered you two way, like cloud-based, local-based data processing. Uh, that's this, um, yeah, this is a very good option. It's a super flexible, and what they developed is very new on the market. It's not only a better sensor, it's like a very great new sensor with a new scan method to combine this two one. And this makes the, the system very unique. And I think it's the, the biggest improvement on the SLAM market. What I saw in the last year to bring something out what is completely new was nobody done this before, and this makes the system super interesting. And I think many people will uh, take advantage from this and will use it for their project. Uh, yeah, I am super excited about the new system. I'm, I cannot wait to work with this and see the data live here. Yeah? And then we give you another update. This, this was the previous with the information what we got before and now we can release it to the release date or we, we can tell it this to you with the release date. And I hope you are super excited like me. Maybe leave, leave your comment here. Yeah, make some comments, uh, subscribe to the channel if you like what we're doing and maybe share it with friends if they don't know from our channel, from the new Faro Orbis. And I say bye-bye, Eric, until the next hot information from the scanner market.